Quill's guns can just make ice out of nothing. You don't have a clue, do you? He won't let me take him apart to find out. I'm gonna say Christmas. No, no, no. Scratch that. Tiny dimensional rifts. How would you... Perhaps it is magic. It's not magic! Guys, I've got something here. It's deep. This looks promising. There's little room to maneuver if something should attack. We're not gonna be here long. Anybody see a way through? We'll make one if we have to. Oh, anybody else smell that? It really stinks back here. Yes, it smells putrid. Ugh. Where is it coming from? Yep, definitely something gross behind here. Drax, can you chuck that through the stink wall? I fear I will break this. Huh? That is disturbingly fragrant. Uh, uh, I am clutching every orifice right now. Okay, that's kind of weird. Hello? Anybody? Okay, that got my <clears throat> blood pumping. Why would Lady Hellbender cage this creature? Uh, because it's annoying as scud? Perhaps it is food. That thing's food? Yes, monster food. I wonder what it tastes like. Peter! Why would it taste like that? We can use this. You know, we really monster gotta food? Your taste buds. The cage! You get it? We need the cage. Taste we go into that fortress with our... With our monster peacefully walking beside us, we'll be laughed right out of the room. Any bites? Why are you whispering? The more thinks we can sell our monster act better if we have a proper cage. Only problem is, there's a pissed off monster inside. Release the beast, let me dispose of it, because that worked so well for you last time. We need a better plan of attack. Yes. Ideally, one that guarantees my safety is needed. Suspiciously like an unproven warrior's first fight. And if it continues this way, it's gonna be our last. Come on, guys. They're not the first ones to try us, and they won't be the last. We have filled many graves. Right? There's been a thousand before them, and they all found out fast. Guardians don't break. Who's with me? Guys! Bring it on! See those branches! Crash! Watch out! These things can really move!
coming with me. We better hurry. Oh, first rain, then jelly, then slimy, stinky crawl spaces, and now all these monsters. I hate this flarking planet! You hate everything, Rocket. True, but especially the stinky slime tunnel part. Hey, we're a team. If we're gonna smell like butt, we're gonna smell like butt together. That is most eloquent, Peter Quill. I will smell like butt with you. Yeah, really great speech. Group, give me a bridge here. The fortress is right on the other side of those cliffs. <laughs> this way, but I don't see an easy way to get up there. Easy is rarely worth the effort. For you, maybe. I love easy. So, what do we do if all don't go well with Lady A? We're gonna fight a monster queen? be a form of your adversary, indeed. Lady Hellbender isn't her adversary. If all goes well, she's gonna be our business partner. It's gonna go fine, right, Groot? Yeah, you being Groot is exactly the problem. Of us gonna get jet boots. Takes years of special training off. <laughs> Deep freeze. Whoa! Can I try ice cubing something? Nope. Man, you're such a gas flat. So if we're gonna haggle with the monster, how much are we asking for our monster? What do you mean? We're running a business here. We need to make a profit this time. Hey, well. Nothing. Don't worry, Rocket. That thing heavy, Quill? Surprisingly light. Whoa, that is definitely my top ten fortresses. Wasted our time. Almost got killed for nothing. And got arrested. That was fun. It was moderately amusing. Now we've got a ticking time bomb on the ship, and we owe money to the cops. All because of one lousy source. Ugh. We just can't catch a break. There's always some stupid blah monster or angry space cops or a random ship explosion kicking us in the teeth. And the weather always sucks. It does. Let's just get this done. You can't be serious. Okay. It's farther than it looked. Much farther. It's a flarkin' infinity bridge, is what it is. Ah, uh, you're being dramatic, Rodent. The bridge ends at the fortress, therefore it is not infinite. Yeah, that's super comforting. Guess we gotta go. Three cycles. Peter? Aren't you forgetting something? Are you Oh! Right! The cage. The point of even getting the Flarkin thing is looking like we mean business. Gru, you ready to squeeze in? Are you Peter Quill. There's still time to reconsider. The tree creature is not very monstrous. Maybe we're going about this the wrong way. Rock is the best escape artist I know. If things go south after the transaction, we're making the right choice. What? We voted on this. I don't feel right putting Groot in a cage. That's because it ain't right. Peter, She'll he... go for it. I think he's made his point. 
Drat. Gamora, can you help me with no. this? What? Why? To guarantee your safety as our leader. Ah, oh, come on. <laughs> She's got you there, Quill. Now shut up and start pulling. I won't. Can you stop worrying so much? You're gonna start growing knots again. Okay, here we go. Whoa! <laughs> okay, whoa, whoa! A little bit close. They seem so peaceful here. Never saw a real well when I was a kid. I guess this sort of counts. I'm sure it's real pretty, but can we not draw its attention while I'm stuck in a flarkin cage, please? song or something we can sing to kill the time. Ooh, ooh, I know one. It's called... Please Stop. All right, yeah. Okay. Wait, is Please Stop the name of your song? No. Okay. So, how long before someone else wants to pull this thing? We are 60 clicks from the fortress. I'd say closer to 75. Well, there is only one way to know for sure. 0 0.1 clicks. 0 0.2 clicks. 0.9, 2.1, 0.3 clicks, 4.5, 0.4 clicks, 0.5 clicks, 0.6 clicks, clicks. For the love of Larkin, stop counting clicks. We could take turns to go into the church and respond to the week. Why are you Thirteen whole years. Look at you. Where does time go? I'll be up in a sec, I promise. Right. Give me a sec. I didn't think you'd actually come up. Maybe being on time is my new thing. Oh, right. We'll see about that when I have to get you up for school tomorrow. You know, I think I'm too old for that, too. Nice try, smart Alec. Sit. Don't worry, I'm not gonna sing. I like your singing. Well, you might be the only one. Go on, make a wish. You're officially a teenager. Look at all those girlfriends. Someone's gonna be really popular at school. Mom. What? You are very handsome. I'm sure all the girls are gonna be falling off. Mom. Home. What did you wish for? Why would I wish for anything? I've got everything I want. <laughs> oh, what huge favor are you about to ask me? Just 10 bucks. Dan, Andy, and I wanna go see Night of the Cosmos at the Rio tonight. A movie? Tonight. Come on, it's gonna be sick. It's about these zombies that invade Earth, and then it's up to these kids that have to blow them away. I don't think I want you to see that, Peter. I let you watch the hockey mask one, and you were sleeping in my bed the next three nights. That was ages ago, and this one isn't even that bad. It's PG-13, and I'm 13. Exactly, PG-13 may contain violence and nudity. Mild nudity, like butts and stuff. You're not helping your case. No, I just, I, I wanted us to have some us time tonight, you know? Maybe finish our game. You can't duck out right when I'm about to win.
Okay, it's not that. It's it's opening night, and it's my birthday, you know? It was meant to be. Meant to be, huh? Pretty please? I don't know. Truck's still in the shop, and I don't want you walking alone in the dark. There's been a lot of weirdos out there. It's not safe. I'll be careful, Ma. I always am. Were you careful when you got that black eye? I told you I, I was- I know! You were standing up for someone, which is a good thing. But you cannot go punching your way out of every problem, Peter. I couldn't just stand there. No. Of course not. Okay, get me my purse. Not so fast. Before you go, there's something I want to talk to you about. Something I want to give you. Twenty bucks? Don't push it. Think of it as a long overdue gift from your father. It's upstairs on my bed. Go on and get it while I finish up in the kitchen. And we can open it together. You know, I was talking to Janie's mom the other day. Uh, here we go. She's a lovely girl, Peter. She listens to disco, Mom. Sometimes Grandma and Grandpa would let me sleep with them if I was too afraid down in the basement. Exactly invested in my safe return. My skin, my plan. Your call, Peter. The Clark it is. I'm the one in the box, lady. Peter Quill is our leader. The burden of your possible death falls on his shoulders. Fully on board with Rocket's plan that I was totally paying attention to. See? Even Captain Space Cadet <laughs> your gymnastics. Wait, God what about coming. gymnastics? I just think we shouldn't be relying on a piece of tech you won't even be around to use. It ain't neutrino splicing, it's a tracker. Even you mouth breathers can figure it out. Name? Guardians of the Galaxy. Never heard of you. I'm Groot. Bonafide monster sellers. Today, anyway. What's in the box? A monstrous abomination from Halfworld and the meanest SOB in the Quadrant. Pass. Pass? Rocket! I mean... Things puny. It is a hell beast, the namesake of your mistress. It would be wise to reconsider. All right, get going before I change my mind. And if the lady don't like it, I'll be carting out what's left of you in that box. Hell beast? It is an accurate moniker. The little beast has a hellish demeanor. I like it. Not exactly an easy way out if this all goes to hell. It's gonna go great. We got a killer monster and a solid plan. I would show more caution, Peter Quill. If Lady Hellbender realizes our deceit, her vengeance will be swift. What? I'm supposed to be scared just because she's got hell in her name? She runs a glorified zoo. That's no zoo. The Monster Queen has a monster army. Any chance they're the zookeepers? With guns? I have never seen one of those tamed. But I have seen one trample a man to pulp. It's fine. Worst comes to worst, we hightail it for the Milano. Your genius plan is run away? Backup plan? Which we're not gonna need, but yeah. It's not like she can chase after us with her old monster mash. Oh, come on. Why did we not simply dock here and avoid the planet's inhospitable surface? 
time to iron out the plan. Now it's foolproof. Lady Hellbender is no fool. When her monster goes missing, she'll assume it was us. Assume, yes, but not no. Not chases across the galaxy level of no, at least. Wow! Look at this place! I'm in the wrong line of work! It is appropriately impressive for a warrior of Lady Hellbender's stature. Someday, that's gonna be ours. Ha! <laughs> not yours. Come over near the cave, and say that again. Focus, guys. Time to get those game faces on. I am Groot. He means you gotta sell the illusion, too. Exactly. A Galeran skull. That is truly a priceless trophy. Behold! Explains the vault. Priceless? Vault? Screw the sneaking around. Let's pull off a good, honest heist. No! no! Follow me and pay attention. You will not approach Lady Hellbender's throne. If she chooses to approach you, you will remain still. No erratic movements. I am humbled by my king's confidence. Spare me your empty attitude. Apologies, my queen. I meant no offense. I know what you meant. Do not blame me for your food. You are not the first to claim they have captured a Tara Tara. You, you doubt its authenticity? If it is what you say it is, prove it. Or suffer the consequence of every other would-be con artist. I assure you, I said, milady. release it. We got this. Bring in the next seller, and transfer 10,000 units to that last one's next of them. Speak. Hey there, I'm Star-Lord. Okay. Drax the Destroyer. <laughs> the undoing of the Mad Titan in the flesh. And such flesh. Your presence honors me. You are much smaller than I expected, then. Oh? <laughs> and what were you expecting? Perhaps I can do something about it. But uh, unlikely. We'll see, Destroyer. I can be quite forceful. She is flirting with me. Just play along, man. Flatter her or something. You got this. Just for the best. Your negotiation skills are terrible. Lady Hellbender. I can see by the size of your weapon that you must be a skillful warrior. Hmm. Perhaps I can give you a demonstration sometime. You 
would make an acceptable opponent. Tell me, Destroyer, what brings you to Sagnarf 9? Peter Quill, show her the creature. When will it reach its big size? Big size? It is a baby, is it not? If you think that's adorable, you should see him drink milk from a saucer. What? I don't even drink milk! Tell her, guys. Isn't Rocket super cute? Oh, yeah. Sometimes we even tie little ribbons with bells with jumpsuit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and if you've never seen a raccoon try to open a refrigerator, you really need to. I ain't a freaking raccoon! The raccoon's temper is quite endearing. <sighs> okay. That's it. I told you. I ain't a freaking raccoon. And I sure as hell ain't freaking cute! <sighs> ah! Ah! <laughs> ah! What are you doing? Land me, Quill! Guys, less talking, more escaping! Look at me, Rocket got us into this mess, he can get us out. Peace, of King. We just gotta get back to all them elevators. Do not get us killed with your recklessness, Rodent. You're lecturing me? You went on an intergalactic killing spree! It's not too late to add one more to that spree. We got company! About time! Slice and dice! To the bone! This must be what it's like to be a rock star! Famously deadly! Work of these weak things. Oh, 
Watch it, Drax! All you, Drax! Perish! Maybe these guys will lead us to the elevator! They do not seem agreeable, Peter Quill! Crush them, Drax! much weight to pull. Joke all you want, but without me, you wouldn't be able to get through this door. Without you, we wouldn't be in front of this door. Like I said, piece of cake. One volt, right for the take. 5,000 units to the Hellraiser who kills these so-called Guardians of the Galaxy. Okay, people, let's do this. One catastrophe at a time. Get back in there, Tiger! Thanks, Gamora! If you run away, you might have lived. No way I was gonna let her take you! We hope to prove an up you don't know a good deal when it's shooting her in the face! No! I could not have handled that better! It's about time! Lady Hellbender should face us herself! Careful what you wish for! Lady Helmand is a mass treasure, it's legendary! Dust in another dust away, freak! Nice work! Find them and kill them! I want them! Getting wet again. 
I don't want to hear one word out of you. You all got a real funny way of saying thanks. Gratitude is not my current sentiment. <laughs> all right, nobody's perfect. Some of us served a mad titan, and some went a little nuts hunting him down. And some of us get a little twitchy, being called cute and pet like a flarkin' flarkin'. I have been called worse. And, knowing you, you probably snapped a bit too. None of this would have happened if we'd just gone with Groot. Well then get off my case and blame Captain Indecisive. I blame the psychopath who started shooting up the place. Oh, keep at it, Hooberry. You wanna see how psycho I can get? Groot says you can all go sit on a hot poker. <laughs> Everybody, quiet! Come on! We'll cut them off at the vault! Perfect. Does not seem perfect. Just another by the numbers plan for the Guardians of the Galaxy. What we should have done is sold Drax. Hellbender was practically begging to buy a night with the big galoot. My gift is not for sale. The house pass still owes us 12,000 units. Twelve? How'd you get twelve? Well, take a deep breath, cause we're here. One vault as promised. And a giant locked door. Leave that to me. Heads up! Ambush! Yeah! We're ambushing them! Oh, hey! Who made that space gear? Oh! Hellraiser! More like Hell lay there and die! Nice work, Peter! Get this done! Round them up, Groot! This is exactly why we should have gone with Groot! Don't throw that, Drax! Then she should have paid me more respect! Rocket. Make it fast. Of course. There ain't a lock this side of Xandar I can't find. I am adding to your debt for every extra minute this takes. Keep your manis on. You can't rush genius. All Hellraisers to the main vault. Or I could try rushing and hope for the best. The skirt Got this one! This is how it's done. How long? There, Rocket. Oh, good. Thanks, Bill. How are you? I'm trying to freaking concentrate. Just looking for an ETA. Whoever Rocket takes, plus whatever evacuation is tracking me. What the scotches Hellraiser feed these guys? Good question. Let's crack them open to find out. Watch out! <laughs> For punch! Lady Hellbender's foes are formidable! 
The trick is to defeat them before they defeat you! Drag with the Indians! We've let ourselves get back into a corner! This room is circular! Unleash me onto these fools! Don't make us a habit! I can always count on you, Kamara! I shall break their bones! My blades grow weary! Then start kicking! This won't is hurt! That hell I Match! From. Good question! One crack of open to find out! Lady Hellbender's forces grow more persistent! Yeah, I think the honeymoon's over! Put them up! With fervor! to win a battle like this, Peter Quill. Order the others to stand down so that I may finish it alone. Uh, no. If anyone's gonna win this alone, it'll be me and my blade. I am good. You think we're in trouble? From these guys? Well, I say trouble is our middle name. Who said we were in trouble? When we're slicing scuts with a knife or a blade, when we're shooting fast and Groot's making shade, that's what I call trouble. Who's with me? Do his that words, was... Man. Something else you need. Hurt. We've let ourselves get backed into a corner! This room is circular! It'll be a slide! And... pop! And close enough. Move your asses while you still got them! You can suck it in that root! Back door! See? Nothing. You! Gamora, no killing teammates! That's who? It's literally in your contract! I made no such commitment. He's a liability, Peter. Ha! Coming from the most wanted woman in the galaxy. The most deadly. Same thing. How about a thank you, Rocket? For nearly getting us killed? <sighs> for getting us into... The crappiest vault in the greater Magellanic Cloud? You said there'd be treasure! A Galeran skull is priceless. Worthless is not the same. Guys! We need a plan! Agreed! My arms are growing... moderately. Dig deep, Drax. Gamora, cover him. Rock and I will try to find something of value. Groot, don't break anything. It's gotta be more than just junk in this skag heap. Pretty ain't priceless. They're just lights, and they look heavy as scut. 
Well, this is not nothing, but here we go. Not quite enough, but we're getting there. That's what I'm talking about. Not such a bad plan, after all. Not exactly good, either. Nice. An assassin's ring. Gamora would get a kick out of this. I have two, and they are sufficient for this task. All right, this will cover our fine at least. Why stop there? After all she put us through, I say we clean her out. What she put us through? Enough! Quill. It's grown quiet. Quiet like peace and quiet, or like the grave sort of quiet? Definitely the grave one. Drax, please tell me you didn't just lock us in. I did not do anything. I'm almost impressed. The woodland creature has more bite than I originally perceived. <laughs> Enjoy the contents of my vault, Guardians. They will be the last thing Peter. you ever see. Shame to waste my Clintarian gas on such unworthy invaders. Do try not to melt all over my Kalaran skull. We need to find a way out. Now! It is both priceless and hard to clean. Cut loose one of those lights. Heads up! Ah, now that was priceless. Drax, throw it right through that wall. With all my might! That'll do her! Let's move, people! I hope you know what you're doing! That makes two of us! Everyone okay? Gamora, Drax? I'll live. Uh, my epithelial layer is intact. Rocky, Groot, where are you? Fork. Does anyone see a way out? I see a bright light. Well, don't go towards it. Guardians of the galaxy. How many times do I have to kill you? Stall her, Peter. The audacity that you thought you could rob me. For the record, we weren't all on board with the plan. Thanks, Quill. Why not sell the clothes right off my back? Do you know what I did to the last people who thought I was easy prey? You let them go? I got nothing. We're trapped. Lady Hellbender! Let us settle this honorably. I will face you in combat. Honorably? Your offer is worthless, Destroyer. There is no escaping my wrath! I can work with that. Dweller! Feast upon them! Monster. Well, let's make it truly dead. 
Don't cause the fear! Let's make you feel it! Do not cower behind your pet, Lady Hellbender! Just focus on the thing trying to kill us! What? Pay for that! Any chance we can talk this over? It's a little late for the sales pitch! Blow him away, Rocket! Now, swing! Make your maker! Dodge this! Now this is a monster worthy of legend! Then we'll be legendary when we kill it! Smoke the rocket! No! Not again! Enough toying with them! Crowd control! Don't forget about the big one! And beware the spine protrusions! Don't have to tell me twice! Oh, you rocket! Buy some time! Alright! We're making progress! It's running out of time! My great strength goes underutilized! This has got my name on it! I thought we lost you for a second. Chop him, Gamora! You don't think she's not gonna let this one go! Because it would be dishonorable to forgive such a slight. I slice off the trees and it grows back! Let come on, you overgrown octopus! Richard does not have eight limbs! Make like a tree and shake it off! Sorry, bud. Hey! Groot says thanks, Quill! The beast must feed upon these gelatinous creatures! That's little comfort, Drax! Flesh from its bones appears to do nothing! Enough with the jelly! Break its bones! Ha! <laughs> Brutify a fruit! I'm ready! Just find me an opening! Do your thing, Drax! Fine! Forget the point! I don't think she cares anymore! We've got to freeze it in its trap! Why would this thing even exist? I don't know, but cutting into them is pretty fun, right? Our efforts have been rendered moot! Now, overwhelm them! Whose idea was it to make these sharp on the inside? Go get them! Let's see that sword! Order up! Destroy that mind! What is next, Peter Quill? Now, attack! Rush them! Light him up, Rocket! It's trying to kill us! Like we don't have enough problems already! Hey, at least the jelly things die real good! You thought you could swindle me swarm and my pets! What's next, Peter? What flavor do you think that one was? I am not sure, but I am sure that you have crushed it! Go, get them! Not gonna chop you down that easy! Destroy! 
Destroy them, knights! Marcus! New gum! Come on, you old octopus! We're gonna cut you into tiny pieces! Now, swing! Now, over! Death has come! Peter! 
out there, Quill. She fought on both sides, remember? Whereas me, I don't need to take sides to mow anybody down. I just love making scumbusters go boom! Okay, okay, I get it. Those creeps out there, fighting them gets the blood pumping. Oh, yeah. But if you listen to that pumping too hard, your heart takes a dive and the losing starts. Stay on target and we'll make them all go boom. Who's with me? Woo top field ah! must wait! Oh, yeah! Escaping Lady Helbig's wrath. We'll see about that. What the? God. 